To install VectorCut on your Windows-based computer, you're going to want to start by logging into your CADWorks Live dashboard, as seen on the screen here. Once logged into the dashboard, you'll go up to the Support section, go down to Downloads, and inside here there is VectorCut 2.0. We're going to go ahead and download that right now. Once downloaded, we'll run the vector cut setup file. And we'll go through the installation prompts. Always, if anything asks for administrator privileges, make sure you press yes. And hit finish. Once the uh, software is actually installed, the installation itself is still not complete. You're going to want to set it up for your cutter as well. So we'll go to All Programs, scroll down to Vector Cut, and go ahead and click on Vector Cut to start it. So once the software is open, you want to make sure you set it up for your cutter. So for this, we're going to have a Roland GS24. Uh, the new GS24 actually runs off the same engine as the GX inside of Vector Cut, so make sure you go ahead and click on that. After you select the proper cutter, the last thing you're going to want to do is go over to the Properties tab. And under Printer Port, you want to make sure you actually select that cutter you want. Uh, by doing this, it'll make sure it knows where that cutter is connected to your computer, and that way when you go to send the cut job, it will go ahead and cut it for you. I'm Joe Burt with Stalls TV.